اعوذبلاجیم آئی سیک دا پروٹیکشن آف اللہ اگینسٹ دا ڈیول بسم اللہ رحمان رحیم ان دا نیم آف اللہ دی موسٹ بینیفیشنٹ اینڈ دی موسٹ مرسیفل ربی شر علی صدری ویسر علی امر ویل الدا تم ملسانی یف کا حکولی او مائی لارڈ اوپن فار می مائی چیسٹ گرینٹ می دی سیلف کانفیڈنس کنٹینمنٹ اینڈ بولڈنیس اینڈ میک لوز دی ناٹ فرام مائی ٹنگ ڈیٹ دی انڈرسٹینڈ مائی اسپیچ السلام علیکم می پیس بلیسنگس اینڈ مرسی آف اللہ بی اپون یو اینڈ ٹو آل دی میسنجرس آف اللہ اینڈ ان پرٹیکولر آن دی نوبل اینڈ دی فائنل میسنجر پروفیٹ محمد پیس بی اپون ایم ہیز فیملی اینڈ ہز کمپینینز ان دس ویڈیو وی ول بی ٹاکنگ اباؤٹ دی آئی ایس ٹوینٹی فور ریلیٹڈ پارٹی ڈسکلوزرز آئی ایس ٹوینٹی فور از اپلائڈ ان آئیڈینٹیفائڈ دی ریلیٹڈ پارٹی ریلیشن شپس اینڈ ٹرانزیکشنس آؤٹ اسٹینڈنگ بیلنسز اینڈ کمٹمنٹس between an entity and its related parties and disclosures about these items this is applicable to both the standalone and the consolidated financial statements related party relationships are a normal feature of a business entities frequently carry out their activities through subsidiaries joint ventures and the associates in these circumstances The entity has the ability to affect the financial and operating policies of the investee through the presence of control, joint control or the significant influence. A related party relationship may have an effect on the profit or loss and the financial position of an entity even if the related party transactions do not occur. Related parties may enter into transactions that unrelated parties will not enter into. Furthermore, the mere existence of the relationship may be sufficient to affect the transactions of the entity with the other parties. Definitions A related party transaction is a transfer of resources, services or obligations between a reporting entity and a related party, regardless of whether a price is charged. Close members of the family of a person are those family members who may be expected to influence or be influenced by that person in their dealings with the entity and include the person's children and spouse or the domestic partner b the children of that person's spouse or the domestic partner and c the dependents of that person's or that person's spouse or the domestic partner Compensation includes all the employee benefits as defined in the IS-19, employee benefits and IFRS-2, share-based payment. Employee benefits are all forms of consideration paid, payable or provided by the entity or on behalf of the entity in exchange for services rendered to the entity. It also includes the such consideration paid on behalf of a parent of the entity in respect of the entity. entity key management personnel are those persons having authority and responsibility for planning directing and controlling the activities of the entity directly or indirectly including any director whether executive or non executive of that entity list of parties that are outside the scope of the related parties the following are not the related parties a two entities simply because they have a director or other member of the key management personnel in common or because a member of the key management personnel of one entity has significant influence over the other entity b the two joint venturers simply because they share the joint control of a joint venture c providers of finance trade unions public utilities and departments and agencies of a government that does not control jointly control or significant influence the reporting entity simply by virtue of their normal dealings with an entity however they may affect the freedom of action of an entity or participate in its decision making process and d a customer supplier franchisor distributor or general agent with whom an entity transacts a significant volume of business simply by virtue of the resulting economic dependence disclosures 
Relationships between a parent and its subsidiaries shall be disclosed irrespective of whether there have been transactions between them. An entity shall disclose the name of its parent and if different, the ultimate controlling party. If neither the entity's parent nor the ultimate controlling party produces the consolidated financial statements available for public use, the name of the next most senior parent that does show shall also be disclosed. An entity shall disclose the key management personnel compensation in total and for each of the following categories short term employee benefits, post employment benefits, other long term benefits, termination benefits, and the share based payments. Examples of the transactions that are disclosed if they are with the related parties. The following are examples of transactions that are disclosed if they are with a related party. Purchases or sales of the goods, whether in finished or the unfinished form. Purchases or sales of the property and other the assets. Rendering or receiving of services. Leases. Transfers of research and development. Transfers under the license agreements. Transfers under the finance arrangements, including the loans and equity contributions in cash or in kind. Provisions of guarantees or the collateral. Commitments to do something if a particular event does occur or does not occur in the future, including the executory contracts and the settlement of the liabilities on behalf of the entity or by the entity on behalf of that related party. Here comes the end of this standard. May Allah, Lord of the heavens and the earth, bless you in this world and in particular in life hereafter. Amen. Have a nice day. Take care. Allah Hafiz.